Hi, Trevor here. I'm going to go over how to do an in-place upgrade for Linux. In this case, uh, it happens to be Ubuntu. We're going to be going from 16.04 to 20.04. Uh, and how it's going to work is we're going to run the update for 16.04 to 18.04. And I'm going to log in as an administrator and we're going to run a command called do release upgrade. And what this will do, if our system is up to date, uh, it will get the packages and files we need for 18.04 and it'll move us up to 18.04. So we're going to do sudo do release upgrade it'll check it sees that we have something there now doing an in place upgrade for Linux will take a while like in this case uh, this is a brand new 1604 system all up to date and everything and this is roughly going to take about 20 to 40 minutes to do depending on your internet speed and the speed of your machine so this will take a while if you are running something critical on it you'll need to schedule downtime or you'll need to uh, find a way to virtualize it, maybe bring the virtual machine up to date and then swap it back in place. Uh, that's something you'll have to decide. And now we have a prompt and I'm going to tell it to continue and then it's going to go out, get the files that we need, upgrade the ones in place and this will take a bit of time so we'll come back to this. So now we've come to uh, prompt uh, configuring uh, grub and because of the way this is set up I'm going to select the install the package maintainers version uh, depending on your needs you may want to keep your local version that's currently installed but in this case I'm going with the install package maintainers version. And now we're to the point where we're going to be getting rid of the obsolete packages. So if you have something specific going on, you just want to be careful. In this situation, I'm going to continue. And now we're at the part where uh, we need to reboot to finish with our upgrade. So we're just going to hit yes and continue. This will just take a minute as so it boots up. You can see there we were on 1804 when we get to the login here 
you can see we're updated now to 18.04.5 and to go on to 20.04 we're just going to upgrade in place again I'm going to check for updates now app get update checks to see uh, for new packages um, it won't remove any packages that are there but the sudo app get dist upgrade uh, will delete software uh, that gets updated so we're up to date so now we're going to run the uh, do release upgrade and since we're on 18.04.5 it's going to check see if there's something new Obviously, it'll find 2004. And there'll be a couple prompts along the way here. I'll just wait for it to finish uh, getting everything uh, sorted out. So we have uh, 350 megabytes uh, to download, to make the changes for. So we're going to go ahead and continue. So now we've come to a prompt about libc6 just telling you that uh, there will be restart, restarts required whether you want to do it automatically or uh, whether you want it to stop and uh, prompt you. I'm just going to select automatic. And now we have uh, a prompt about LXD snap. Uh, it's just purely informational. Uh, and uh, I'm just going to select OK. And now we have another prompt configuring LXD. 4.0 should be used for production, but let's just for. Uh, the fun of it, let's just select latest just because this is just a demo for doing uh, a Linux distro upgrade. And now we're gone through, gone through most of the upgrade. Uh, we have some packages to remove. We don't have anything to worry about, so we're going to continue. And now our upgrade has gone to the point where we can reboot now, and then we'll reboot into 2004. So we're going to select yes and see our final result. This will just take a minute. And there we are. You can see at the top there, you went to 20042 LTS. We're good to go, fully upgraded and up to date. I hope you found this video useful. Have a great day.